Hey guys, it's another three marker challenge video and yeah, I'm actually, I don't know, it was really exciting doing this again because I've been really meaning to do it. <laughs> and it actually turned out pretty decent. I'm pretty happy with it. And yeah, so this first part's just me randomly picking colors and my eyes closed and just spun the paper and picked whatever color was the closest to my finger. Um, that was actually the second take, because the first take, the first three markers I chose, were literally so close to the previous three marker challenge video I did, I just, I couldn't do it. I had to pick a different, I had to do it again, like, pick another three colors and hope that they were different. It was ridiculous. It was a dark blue, another really light brown, and like a really light yellow or something. It's like, I can't do that, that's not fun. I need something different. <laughs> I ended up picking some foresty colors, which actually worked out and unintentionally made this a fan pro picture. I'm sorry. Okay, it's fan pro. I just... It wasn't my fault. That's just how the universe wanted it to happen. Blame the universe, not me. <laughs> anyway, so the colors were so close to um, 737, which I still haven't named her yet. I, I'm totally still open for suggestions, <laughs> but yeah, they were so close to her. It just worked out. It was funny because I didn't even, I, like I thought of Forest, and I didn't exactly think of her yet until I showed Alex the colors I got and he's like, oh, that makes me think of a forest. And I was like, yeah, that's what I was thinking. <gasps> Fan pro. And thus this picture. <laughs> and yeah, it was a little weird with the G17. I was just a little worried about how it was working out because the the brown and the blue green were working out pretty well together and then when I threw down the green it was just whoa so saturated and different but I think I made it work and I think actually the white gel pen in the end really saved the day there but yeah it was a little bit of a struggle but I like it a lot better than the last one <laughs> aside from the glaring anatomy mis mistake and uh, yeah, that'll forever bother me, but whatever. <laughs> so hopefully you guys have noticed that the footage isn't actually shaking. Oh, I'm so proud. I got a new camera. Yes. And it's a lot heavier than my old camera. And I'm just so happy right now that this footage is not shaking. And I hope that that keeps happening with this camera. <laughs> and then I could do more traditional videos without like fear of ruining the footage. <laughs> but yeah, so that's exciting and I'm happy about that. And yeah, so anyway, I haven't really talked too much about what's going on in the video aside from random stuff, but just shading right now, mostly her hair. I didn't actually put the brown in her hair and I feel like I probably should have now that I'm looking at the picture. Just, I don't know, add a little bit more of a shadow-ish sort of color, but even without it, I feel like it still worked out. I mean, the blue-green worked pretty nice as like a kind of highlight sort of thing and really helped to desaturate the green. The green was so saturated. It just stood out way too much for comfort. I actually left a little bit of the really saturated green at the bottom. It's probably not even noticeable because I colored over it with the blue-green and that desaturated it, but I didn't do that at the very, very, very bottom. And it's it, if you're looking at it in real life, it's got this little nice gradient. It's so small. It's so small. I'm not even sure why I'm talking about it. <laughs> but anyway, so here's the highlighting with the gel pen. And if you notice, I put my finger on sometimes where I drew with it. It's because it lifts off some of the ink and because I didn't want too much white, I don't want it to overpower it too much. So, use my finger, picks up some of it while it's still wet, and there we go. 3 mark challenge number two. <laughs> Hope you guys like it, and yeah, I'll see you in the next video. Bye!